Key Lemon, this, um, they're named after my cats. Um, and my idea is also based, inspired by my cats. Because, you know, my cats, they like to sleep, and when they sleep, they purr, and unfortunately, they sleep um, 16 hours a day, and I'm out of, I, I can't hear them 16 hours a day because I work 8 hours and I sleep 8 hours. Therefore, um, and so, so I thought, okay, well, maybe when I'm not at home that time, right, I can't hear them purring because, you know, the cat purring is very calming, right? So maybe I can use my Max fan and simulate a purring. So as it turns out, cat purring right, is a very serious scientific thing. Like, there's a website dedicated to cat purring. Um, and there's this one dude who wrote like one, two, three, four, five scientific papers about cat purring and presented some more. <laughs> And um, turns out that I'm not the only person who experimented with um, generating cat purrs. Um, these fellas also, they scientifically go and generate their cat purr um, use, using a motor. It's actually quite legit. Um, <laughs> and as I was I'm trying to modulate the fan, uh, the fan spinning up and down in time, right? Um, the numbers that I use also actually is scientifically proven one because... <laughs> eh, <laughs> because... Ta-da! <laughs> I don't even know what half of this thing means. <laughs> but the point is... A cat purrs at about roughly around 20, at on average 24 hertz. And the ingress and uh, egress time, which is the brief in, brief out time, is roughly, it varies from cat to cat. La. The smaller the cat, the shorter it is. The bigger the cat, the longer it is. Right? So um, I enabled it on my left fan. Um, I will need complete silence for this. I don't know whether you can hear the fan or not, but if you cannot, then um, I have a recording. I'll play the recording after. So, um, there's a two second warm up. Can you hear? Um, yeah, so um, if that wasn't very clear, I'll play the video. Um. So um, unfortunately, the, the pitch of the fan is a lot higher than the cat's pitch because the cat is a lot lower pitch and sounds more like a drill. <laughs> um, so it actually sounds more like a human breathing or a sea wave or something like that which is all kind of calming also but it's totally useless because if you were to actually use this at work um, your mic your mac might actually blow up and then you might actually not need the excuse cat generator to because to work anymore because you actually don't have a mac to work anymore so Sorry? Has your cat tried to lick your laptop? Um, I didn't bring my cat today, so... <laughs> <laughs> Try it and let us know. Yeah. Um, they... I might not have the chance to try because when I open my bag, they will just sit on top of it. I can't even run the command anymore. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> any questions? Comments? Oh yeah, uh, is that... Oh, it's just... Okay, hang on, please. 
Done. Okay. Thank you very much.